Hi, welcome or welcome back to my channel. So in this video, as you can see by the title, today I'm going to be doing a claw clip ponytail on my hair. I actually did film like a sit down talking intro for this video, but I don't know, my energy was just kind of low. So I decided to just go ahead and do a voiceover and I'm gonna just do a voiceover for the rest of the video. All I was really saying in the intro was how, you know, I took a long break, a nice long break from uh, doing videos and now I'm back doing videos. Best believe I'm gonna have a lot of content coming out, so make sure to subscribe, stay subscribed, uh, subscribe if you're not already because uh, I have more content coming out. But moving on to this video here, as you guys just saw, I took my hair out of my t-shirt. I just co-washed my hair, which is just conditioner. I didn't use shampoo. And now I parted my hair and now I'm using this uh, olive oil. It's like a cream, like a curl cream kind of. It smells so good. Or no, it's a curl uh, pudding. That's what it is. It smells so good. Um, and I'm just putting that on that section of my hair. And yeah, just running it through. It smells really good. It's moisturizing and all that. I'm basically just gonna show y'all first how I do like a normal little slick back or slick down ponytail whatever um but yeah added that i use water added that to my hair and i'm just detangling my hair and just running that through So once I feel like my hair is fully detangled, I'm using my Eco Styler Gel. This is the olive oil um, kind. And I'm just putting that, I'm putting that only on the top part of my hair. And like where you see me putting it at, that's the only place I put it. And I'm not even using a lot. And I'm using my brush and I'm just slicking it back. I don't like, when I do a slick back, I don't like my hair to still be like glued to my head when I take my ponytail holder out. So I don't use too much force or anything. Um, and I'm slicking it back. I use a little bit more gel, just a little bit more gel, um, just to put any or get any flyaways and frizz, you know, down. So then I tighten my ponytail and this is what it looks like um, when I'm done. So now for the pieces that are left out, I'm taking more gel and I'm just kind of running that through the ends of my hair and like defining my curls at the end. Um, I don't want it to be, you know, I don't want it to look frizzy and dry and like poofy at the end. I want it to be like a nice curl. So I just run it through. I don't really coil finger coil or whatever the hair I just run it through and then I'm using my equal uh or edge booster and I'm going on my edges and just doing my edges with my edge brush y'all can just watch me do that I kind of want to do an edge video like how I do my edges or whatever um I was gonna do a little bit more than this like make it a little bit more extra but I just kept it simple because of the you know hair clip in the back but Y'all let me know if you do want an edge tutorial because I really kind of want to do one. But at the same time, like if nobody's going to watch it, I'm not going to do it, you know. But anyways, y'all can just continue watching me do my edges. Once I'm done with that, I'm using my brush and I'm just slicking my hair back even more. Um, you know, you do your edges, your hair is like kind of sticking out at the top there, if that makes sense. Now onto the best part of the video, the part y'all been waiting on. Um, this is the clip that I'm going to be using. This one is from Shein. Um, it came in a double pack, but the other one I can't find, so I use this one. So I'm starting off with, um, and I turned around so you guys can see, but I like twisted my hair up and I put just put the clip on. Now you can see my like satin scrunchies, but I didn't really care that much. It's not that big of a deal to hide that. Um, so I'm basically opening up the clip and I'm trying to secure it. I'm trying to secure it on my scalp, my actual like scalp, you know, my hair, the root of my hair, my roots, I guess. And then my actual hair that's like in the twist if that even makes sense, that probably doesn't even make sense, but you, you can kind of see what I'm doing here. I'm trying to connect it on my roots and on my actual hair. Um, but this is what it looked like when I did it the first time. It wasn't, one, it wasn't secure, and then it just didn't look right to me. It was too low. So I went back in and tried again, and unfortunately, uh, it broke. 
it broke um as y'all can see i was so i wasn't upset like that because honestly it was my fault i was pulling on it a little bit too hard and also like girl i have thick hair like i don't know why i was doing all that i should have braided my hair at the root and then put the clip in but either way i went ahead and i still wanted it to work so i put in another satin scrunchie and i'm just like slipping the clip in there um i'm probably not i'm not gonna wear this out but i just want to do that for like picture purposes i really wanted this to work um so i did that it was still really low but it was fine um i was okay and satisfied with that but i definitely want to try this out again and then braid my hair um but that's what it looks like it's not horrible you know it's still like put together it's good enough for pictures but this is the final look and how the hair turned out Hope you guys liked the video and if you did, make sure to like, comment, subscribe for more content and more videos from me. More videos will be coming out here soon, so I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!